Hey everybody, welcome to this old arcade. My name is Ricardo. On this episode, I like to um, work on this joystick, uh, the control panel. Now, um, if you see here, let me move this out of the way. The previous person that had it decided to, you know, punch some holes in here. Also, this area here, so. It, it messed up a lot of the um, the joystick part. So, as you see right here in the back side, the guy ripped off the the screws, which are right here. Now, what I'm gonna try to do is I got these little small carriage bolts that I can actually use. Um, what I'm gonna have to do is uh, drill them out. see here so if I just get the drill be able to you know make it a little bit bigger so the um, if you see the the grooves oh, I'm trying to get it you see those little grooves right there which is like a square well, they're originally from on these square ones right here. They're made for it so it can go flush inside there. So what I want to do is uh, I want to get them drilled down and just uh, just have them pretty good, pretty good uh, flush in there. So when I close it, it's not gonna affect the control panel so if I right now it's kind of like lifting up a little bit so that's what I want to do so all right let's go and do that all right so what I did is I drilled some holes make them a little bit bigger and as you go and see kind of a little bit flusher than so when I actually put the screen in here it's, you know, it's not as pupping as, you know. So I'm able to flip it around and got myself my screws right there. So, so if I get the joystick. There we go. <coughs> Screw these guys in and. Regardless, it's a joystick. So, all right, let me go ahead and uh, do that, and uh, we'll be right back. All right, so what I'm gonna do is uh, make sure Now what I'm trying to do is um, I don't want to um, really tighten it completely because I want to. Oops, sorry. <laughs> Everything's slipping on me. I just want to do you know just like a. But if you see here, you see that guy we did it. Cut the hole right there. Cut it right there. Here, here, and here. So kind of, he kind of ruined it. The other, this one. But I'll fix it. Um, 
And as you see, it's kind of set pretty good. I'm actually kinda happy with it. So my plans on this one is, um, as I go on, um, I like to uh, see. I'm gonna have to um, like get a sander and sand it all the way down so it's like real flat so it, it won't be bumping up like that or the other way that I can actually do is uh, <coughs> cut that piece out cut the, the top part and um, let me see if I can get one of these guys what I can do is I can probably get like a longer um, I can probably get a longer um, screw cut it and then solder it, um, I mean weld it, right at the bottom, so, but for right now, um, this will work for the moment, but, uh, put this guy in there, in the coming episodes, I'm gonna be, uh, we're gonna tear these apart, we're gonna go ahead and uh, redo them all, making sure that everything's clean and working. But for right now, I'm just doing it as a as a test to see how it feels and how. But now the problem is, is that that guy wherever. The, Oh, this one's working. What happened is the guy just messed with it so badly. Um, I'm thinking then they're gonna have to be rethreaded. So. So this screw right here, I'm gonna have to uh, rethread it because it's pretty damaged from the guy this just just going at it and butchering this control panel. Kind of, I don't know why he decided to turn it into a JAMA, but well, here's your example. Real joystick. So what's going to happen is it's all sticky right now. I'm going to have to tear it apart. And that's going to be on our next episode. We're going to go ahead and tear the whole joystick apart. Clean it up. Re-gear it. Re <coughs> I'll put some oil. Uh, I mean some grease in there. And um, yeah. Get these guys. That's what I love about these controllers is that they really, really don't go bad. They're, they're always uh, good. Um, so yeah. So we're just going to go from there. Um, so we see right here, these are little switches that um, I got from Tim for on our Christmas episode. And um, with these guys, what happens is uh, you put the button inside right there and it goes on, on it. And um, it um, pretty much uh, holds on to it and, you know, does the, the clicking into it so there's a total of 16 of them so um, the problem is I got these guys but I don't have the buttons because uh, the problem about the buttons is that they're so easy to break <coughs> they don't <coughs> um, they were not 
felt very well. Um, and uh, they tried doing some re um, um, reproductions, and they, they, they really don't come out pretty well because the hole on it right here is too small on the reproductions, and you gotta like literally <clears throat> push them in very well, and they break. And um, uh, so, what I'm gonna do is hopefully I can find me some buttons. If in case I can't, um, worst case scenario, I'm gonna have to go with uh, half buttons and uh, <coughs> do the do the ones you know, uh, red, black, uh, red, black. I think it's uh, orange, yellow, purple, green, um, and those modes. I need to check out the correct. Uh, mode on it but uh but other than that yeah I just wanted to uh show you guys a uh, little update uh, next thing I'd like to do is uh you know like I said redo these joysticks um powder coat these guys um sand them down and um hopefully I can uh either powder coat them or just uh respray them um do uh, bring them back to his original state um so yeah that's uh pretty much it so um i'm gonna go ahead and do the other one on the other side and uh, naturally install four joysticks so other than that that's about it homer is getting comfortable in my chair and he likes he likes to just kick back huh homer <laughs> Well, that's about it. Uh, thank you so much for watching this. Okay, we'll see you next time.